Hey YouTube, welcome and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Leah Monet, and today we have another shoe haul. So you all really enjoy the boot haul, which I will link up here somewhere. And so I said, let's go ahead and run it back. But this time we're gonna use some sandals because we're coming up on like our spring and summer months. Again, this is going to be big feet friendly. So I wear size 11. So everything in here is gonna be either an 11 um, or 12. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and start trying shoes on. Everything is $30 or less, so everything is super affordable. And I got everything from either Target, don't sleep on Target, or uh, my local beauty supply store. So let's go ahead and just jump right into the shoes. Alrighty, so up first, I have some sandals from my local beauty supply store. So my sister actually purchased these in Atlanta Beauty Supply. Um, when I was home in Michigan and Detroit, I seen these in a beauty supply store there as well. They're super cute. They have the bedazzles on them and then you have the square toe. Um, super cute and they do have a cushion in them as well. I have these true to size in a size 11 um, and they do have a little bit of a cushion down here, which is great. So we'll go ahead and try these on, see how they fit and see how they feel. These get a 10 out of 10 for look. I love the bedazzles. I love the square toe. I just love the design of this sandal. It's really cute. It kind of goes with literally everything. So these will definitely be a go-to pair for this summer. As far as the fit, I'm going to give these a 7 out of 10. And that is because the straps around the foot are a little bit loose. So when I was walking, I kind of found myself trying to keep the sandal on as I was walking. But overall, love the sandal. So all of the rest of the shoes in the haul are going to be from Target. I'm kind of mad that I'm telling y'all my secret because it's already hard enough finding 11s, let alone 12s. Um, but yeah, it is what it is at this point. So the next sandals that I have, they remind me of the first one just because they have the square toe, but these are going to be a little bit more um, of a nude look. They feel a little bit more sturdy, just kind of feel like they have a little bit more weight to them. Probably just better quality overall compared to the beauty supply store shoe. I don't feel like there's as much cushion on these, but we'll see once we try them on. I'll rate them for comfortability as well. Um, but yeah, overall, it's just kind of like a standard everyday shoe. Um, they aren't bedazzles, but they are kind of like 3D um, little stones here for design. So these ones, again, were $17.50, and I have these in a size 11, which is true to size for me. These get an 8 out of 10 for look. I like the style of the sandal. Again, I'm loving the square toe. I like the stone embellishments they have on here. But it's more of a chill, more neutral type of sandal. So it's not super loud or anything that's like attention grabbing. So they'll get an 8 out of 10. As far as the fit, I will give these ones a 9. You can see the straps on these are a lot more snug on my feet. And it gives me that support kind of around my ankles where I don't feel like I have to keep the shoe on. So these ones fit much better. All right, so the next shoe I have, again, it's going to be from Target. I have these in a size 11. These were $25, and these are some black slides. Let me take it off so you can see the design. But it's just kind of like a, it almost, it looks like a Cuban link kind of thing. But again, these ones have a square toe. Maybe it's like square toe summer season because I didn't even notice that when I ordered these ones. But again, these kind of feel like the other ones, they have a decent weight to them. They have a little bit of, I don't even know if you call this a heel, um, a little platform. Um, but these ones are leather. Yeah, I think I like these ones. They're cute. These again are going to be like everyday sandals and slides. I'm like a slides girl. I don't like having to strap shoes up around my ankles. It just takes too much time. I like to be able to slide and go. I like to be able to kick my shoes off. Um, so yeah. These ones will get an 8 out of 10 for the look. I love the style of it. It's just a slide, kind of like a standard shoe with the Cuban link. So it gives it a nice little design to it so it's not super plain. I can probably get away with wearing these ones to work. Um, but again, it's nothing over the top, just kind of a standard shoe. For the fit, I'm going to give these ones a 7 out of 10. And that is because these ones are going to be on the more narrow side. So it's not overly narrow, but if you had a wide foot, I would probably stay away from these. All right, these neck sandals, I was kind of going back and forth on these ones because I'm like, I don't know. But the reviews, everybody in the reviews really loved the shoe. And I saw somebody that had like the same kind of hesitation. She said like, I wasn't sure about ordering these and I got them and I love them, they're comfortable. So I know I just said that I'm not like a strap up type of gal, but these ones have a Velcro strap. So I, I can make do with that. Um, 
but this is what they look like i think this is going to be a shoe that i just need to see on and for some reason i ordered these in a size 12 so my guess is someone in the review said that you should probably size up with these otherwise i would have just ordered these ones true to size but this is what they look like. These are going to be a little bit heavier. As you can see, the platform is a little bit thicker. But they have the Velcro straps. They remind me of like, I think Tom, um, Tommy Hilfiger or somebody had like some sandals that were kind of like a similar design as these ones. Um, but if these were $14. And that's one of the reasons why I said, well, let me just go ahead and add them. If I hate them, I can always return them. It's Target. Um, but for $14, if I had a cute sandal, I like the color of them, so I'm, you can always match it up. It's not going to be like an everyday shoe just because of the color. But if I got a cute sandal for 14 bucks, I won't complain. So, yeah, we'll see how these ones look on. So, whoever said these were cute in the Target reviews can go to hell. These ones for look, I'm going to give a three. Oh my God, I hate this sandal. It gives me like grandma, especially from the side. From the front, it's not terrible. I don't know. I, I, I just, I don't know. As far as the fit, um, I don't even know why I'm continuing. The fit, I mean, honestly, I sized up and I didn't need to. So I feel like I had too much extra space and the shoe was too big. So the next shoe that I have for you is actually a heel. It's not a sandal, but it's a heel that I got for work because I just needed some new, like everyday, small, you know, kitten pumps for the office. And so I seen these, I was a little reluctant because they are suede. But honestly, once I put on my foot, they didn't look bad, but they're just kind of like the standard heel. Um, the heel height is not bad. So these should be fairly comfortable to walk in and stand in, you know, try to run the office. Um, so yeah, I just needed like a new nude heel. And I ordered these true to size. These are a size 11. I seen a lot of people in the comments saying, um, to order a size down personally when I'm ordering a pointy toe shoe I typically like the size up because they never have enough room with there for your toes to be comfortable so I went ahead and I kept the 11 just because of the reviews and hopefully these will fit so we shall see as we do our trial for look I'm gonna go with the 9 for these and that's because these are just kind of like a standard heel they have the pointy toe um, a decent size heel um, so yeah just kind of like a standard work shoe I was a little bit nervous about the suede but honestly in person it looks a lot more versatile for the fit um, because I went true to size I am happy with how this shoe fits um, so it feels good it felt comfortable to walk in so I am looking forward to wearing these around the office so that's all the shoes that I had for you all today. I found some really cute, affordable finds. Um, so hopefully you see something in this video that you liked. If you did, be sure to give this video a thumbs up. I'm trying to look out for my...